Um, let me just scan through them. In addition to that, I also have these that won't really fit on the um, shells. Oh, this is my shatter. I'm kind of annoyed. I guess it didn't close it tightly enough, but if you can see, it like shattered in the bottle. Some glitters. Um, and then in the back, I have like the boring stuff. I have some solar oil. That's my base coat and my top coat. I have some drip dry drops. More of them. Um, nail polish than their spray. Uh, so far away, this is what the shelf looks like, and I think it's really pretty. Um, I kind of try to have it in rainbow order, but obviously that doesn't work completely for some of them, which kind of annoys me at the same time. But I have to eventually all um, organize it completely. Uh, um, it would take forever to go through every color, so I think I'm just going to go through the row, like just scan through the row, so you can see it in more detail and. Um, if you want me to find out a color, just tell me um, where it is, and I will do my best to try and find it again. Um, these are just like acrylic things. I think my mom got them at like online somewhere. I'm not really sure. Um, but here are the colors, and on my camera they kind of look all the same, but they're really not in person. Um, like just to give you like I guess a reference like this is neon orange and that is like a pumpkin orange so yeah and some of these are more pink um yeah like Down here you can see I have my like nail pens and these are just mini ones. He's oh yeah, and then usually I do not keep these things here, but I just brought them out because otherwise I forget about them. Just like some nail buffing things, nail file, a nail dotting tool. Actually, I don't know where my dotting tool is right now. I have to find that. Like two nail brushes and like a nail polish remover thing. So I'm going to show you some of my favorites. Um, as for reds, I kind of go through phases. I, sometimes I don't really like reds on my nails, and that's kind of the phase I'm in now. Um, but when I do like reds, this is like one of my favorites. Uh, this is OPI Cajun Shrimp. I think one of my all-time favorites is uh, this China Glaze. It's a Tiffany Blue. As you can see, it like, matches my walls almost exactly. Um, and it's called For Audrey, and I love this color because Tiffany Blue is like my favorite color. I also love this, which is by OPI. Kind of more pearly in person, and I'm actually wearing it right now. My nails look disgusting. It's Italian Love Affair. Um, this is not quite a Tiffany Blue. It's like minter. I don't know how to explain it. Um, mint Candy Apple. This one's kind of kind of a strange color, but if you can see, there's like really cool green and reflex in it, so it looks like a rainbow on your nails. Um, but this is really old. This is from the designer series. I don't really know how many years ago, um, but it has like the silver thing. DS Illuminate. Just a basic everybody needs in their collection. Um, this one in particular is just a white um, alpine snow. Um, and it's just a white, and I love this just for, like, my plain nails or just decorating because, like, white always goes with everything. This one, Lilford Lilac or something. I don't really know what that is. But it's just, like, a brown, but it has, like, a purple undertone to it, so it's really, really pretty on your nails. Um, I'm really into, like, tans and colors that are kind of ugly but just are so ugly they're pretty. This is my, like, all-time favorite brown. doesn't really look like I use that much, but I wore this so much in the winter. I think it's definitely more of a winter color because it's too dark for summer, but it's OPI Tickle My Francie. It is so gorgeous on.